Yo, what up, YouTube? What up, boxing fans? He came fight news here, and apparently, we might have some major, major news coming up in the next few days. Although to me, it's it's very, very uh, outlandish. But out of the UK, there are several sources, including Mail Online. Several sources out of the UK, uh, basically uh, pre-announcing a fight that Amir Khan has finalized the deal with Floyd Mayweather. The fight's going down May 3rd. Um, that's the word, you know, especially since Khan pulled out of his fight versus Devin Alexander. Um, and it could be a massive money fight where Khan is bringing sort of a different look for Floyd Mayweather, uh, a speedy, a very fast approach, you know, a lot of combinations. However, we didn't really see that against uh, Julio Diaz. Uh, this is what is being reported. The official announcement will be made in, in the next few days. And Khan has already pulled out of his challenge to world welterweight champion Devin Alexander, scheduled for December 7th in New York, to ensure that his dream fight with Mayweather is not jeopardized. It's funny how, um, you know, they they look at Khan as a as a speedy guy that'll give Mayweather problems, but Devin Alexander's just as fast and is more skilled. Yet he is not brought up in the discussion like uh, like he's not a legitimate threat. I think Khan has zero chance of beating Mayweather. I'm sorry, this is a fight where Khan is just not prepared. Uh, to fight a legitimate welterweight. He's just not. He couldn't even hold his own at 140. How is he going to deal with the likes of Floyd Mayweather when the guy on his undercard knocked you the fuck out? Like, are you serious? Team Khan has also um, apparently denied the Mayweather rumors amid speculation from the UK um, the UK sort of media and this is what Team Khan had to say uh, Team Khan would like to dispel recent reports that Amir Khan has pulled out of a potential matchup against Devin Alexander taking up a fight against Floyd Mayweather in May of next year contrary to the story Amir Khan is currently in training camp in San Francisco with the aim of fighting again in December against Alexander once an agreement can be reached so, completely different um, story is being announced by Amir Khan today. So, this is very, very um, intriguing because I don't think the, the UK media is just making this shit up. However, you know, this kind of news, are, are they running with a story they're not 100% sure of? It could be the case. But I swear to fuck, if Amir Khan is fighting Floyd Mayweather at this point in time, this is the last time I ever freaking buy. I don't care who Mayweather, I'll never buy a Mayweather fight if he fights Amir Khan at this point in time when there are other legitimate opponents. And normally, I have to say it's against the norm in terms of how Floyd Mayweather has selected opponents because normally he fights guys coming off big wins, not unimpressive performances against C level opposition. He fights guys coming off big wins against B and A class competition. You know. Austin Trout was a big win for Canelo and Mayweather took the fight. Victor Ortiz, Robert Guerrero had pretty big wins. Mayweather took the fight. Amir Khan got knocked down multiple, almost multiple times and hurt uh, in the 11th and 12th rounds versus Julio Diaz, uh, a past prime former champion. That is way out of Mayweather's league in terms of uh, opponent. And, you know, Amir Khan still hasn't proven himself at welterweight. He shouldn't even be ranked as a welterweight. But, um,. You know, politics and boxing will always be politics and boxing. And fights who don't deserve title shots 
suddenly get title shots. Like, this shit happens. However, I think there are a lot of more guys that are more worthy, especially uh, if Tim Bradley beats Marquez. I'm sure Mayweather can wait a month, or even, not even a month, two weeks, to see what happens between Marquez and Bradley. Because we know if Bradley wins, that's a mega option. That's just a, that's the real style that would be, that would give Mayweather challenges. And Tim Bradley also said that. Uh, in a recent article so overall that's where we stand right now we're sort of in the gray matter versus with Amir Khan versus Floyd Mayweather I don't think it's gonna happen next but let me know what you guys think is that what you guys really want to see it is what it is man peace out take care